Hey, gentlemen. Uh, okay, I can't even tell you how much I'm loving this show. I am so obsessed with this series. And Sam, I mean, you got big boots to fill, that's for sure. But what I love most about it is because after every episode, I go and I Google. I need to know more about these real life historical figures. Did you do the same? Like, how Viking savvy were you? Yeah, no, I definitely dived into the research. I actually remember where I was sitting in Mr. Gill's history class, learning about Leif Erikson and Eric the Red. Oh, cool. Uh, I dived into like all the sagas, uh, Greenlander sagas and Eric the Red, the uh, sagas of Eric the Red. And um, yeah, it was, it was definitely important for me to learn all of that. But ultimately, it's a, it's a human story coming back to matters of the heart. And so... It was kind of about a man trying to find his way in the world. And although, you know, he is a man, I still see it as like a coming of age story. Yeah, yeah. And he, like I said, he's, you know, he's he's hailed as this huge hero. And that's that's a lot on his shoulders. That's for sure. So um, kudos. he sees that, though, you know. Yeah. He, he's, he doesn't see himself as a legend. He's just looking after the people that he loves. Exactly. Uh, Leo, congratulations to you. I think you're doing such an amazing job on this show. And I got to say, for a female watching this show, you two men, holy <laughs> mackerel, the dirtier you get, the better, as far as I'm oh. concerned. <laughs> wow. Thank you, Bonnie. <laughs> you're, you're turning the color of my I'm <laughs> say I mean Harold you know I, I I can't put my finger on him I think he's a really good guy I really do how, how, what's your take on him yeah it's it's interesting that you say that because he's there are he's a well-rounded character in this show and there are yeah. good bits to him and bad bits to him and I, I think he's he's so fueled by revenge that uh -huh. that there's a there's a darkness and an, and an anger in there that comes out on the battlefield and that's quite overwhelming to witness he's He's this force of nature on the battlefield. Yeah. Um, but at the same time, he's got these clear aspirations of, of becoming king of Norway. But I think one of the really nice things for me in the role was, yeah, there are those big battlefield moments, yes. those big rousing speeches. But with Harold's relationship with Freydis, there's a real gateway into the vulnerability and the sensibilities of this young man who's, who's at the top of like Viking, society and he's figuring out that it's a rough world out there and those moments of intimacy with with Freydis are, are fun to play and really useful as a character to to really get stuck into what he's about yeah absolutely the, oh god the psychology of these characters too it's, it's a lot to unpack um Sam you know the battle scenes the fighting like everything that's going on it's so meticulous in the show the sets but I got to ask you about that London Bridge scene, um, that whole episode. I was riveted, honestly. What was it like to shoot something like that? Thank you. Yeah, no, that, that's an epic scene that involves so many people, you know, and it's a really beautiful example of like, it literally takes a village for such, a, such an epic episode to happen. Um, yeah, it was, it was really brilliant. I think for each of us to enter in our own worlds and, you know, I've read the scripts, so I'm, I'm seeing what everyone else is doing, but I don't see it until the final right. product. And so to see it all put together was amazing. Um, Stephen St. Ledger directed that episode and he's pretty amazing at putting these action sequences together. Yeah, and Leo, just quickly, yeah, I just want to ask also, but just about the fighting scenes and everything, how you guys have to prepare for this. That's a lot of work. It's you guys fighting there. Come on. It's us fighting. We're looking in the whites of the eyes of these in, this incredible stunt team that have taught us all of our steps. So yeah, there's a lot of training and choreography that goes into it. Um, and yeah, you need to be you need to be in good shape to survive the 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 kind of relentless training that there is. Because as soon as you finish one battle sequence or fight, the next episode you've got something else. So so you're on to the next thing very very quickly. Yeah, well, good thing Freitas is on both your sides. I'll tell you that much, boy. Does she ever kick ass? Oh, Whoa! Uh, yeah. Have you, have you seen all eight? Yeah. Well, kick oh, ass. Her, her final fight scene is incredible. Yeah, that's going to be, yeah. No, it's it's awesome. Well, congratulations to both of you. I love, love, love this series, and I love watching you guys. And uh, just just keep it coming, okay? I appreciate it. I really do. <laughs> Thank you for uh, your cheers. time. Thank okay, you bye, guys. Bye.